explosion! Oh, it's working. Our shoes look cute. Hey. Okay. Yeah. Like Coke bottle. As we go a little something like this, hit it! I've never done that. Me neither. What we're going to do is drop the Mentos into a Coke bottle and see what happens. Because we heard a rumor. Here, you want to eat one? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Should I do four? Just to make it dangerous? Go for it. Unfortunately, it was no explosion, but the Mentos did cause the coke to react in an unusual way. Why, you ask? Due to a process called nucleation. This is where the carbon dioxide in the soda is attracted to the Mentos. All the carbon dioxide, known as fizz, is looking for a way out of its compressed chambers. The Mentos sink to the bottom with all its microscopic nooks and crannies. It forms an incredible number of bubbles and forces all the pressure out, which causes a geyser effect. We wanted to see if the same reaction would happen after the initial reaction, adding more Mentos to the already exploded Coke. So we wanted to see what would happen after the chemicals mixed, dropping more Mentos in. As you can see, half of the bottle is gone. It's coming up a little bit, but not really. I think that once the Mentos go in there, the reaction has already happened, and so it, you can't have... Nope, nothing really. And that's all she wrote. Oh, I love this science shit.